this is closed or open. Open is the gas is flowing. You want it closed when you're not using Show it. Show me what it looks like closed. This is closed. Okay. And there's arrows. So if I want to open it, I follow the arrow to open it. So I'm opening it up right now okay. and I'm sending gas out of the tank. Okay. Now, nothing's going to go in here because this is sit on off. It's okay. off here, but the gas is able to go from here into this tube, but it stops right here. Okay. All right. If you want to light this, then you start on the left hand side, close to the igniter. Okay. You see the orange, orange. Yes. And then the white. Yes. So you push it to the orange. When you push it from off to the orange, it's going to allow gas to flow from the tank to this burner. Ow. Oh. Hot. <laughs> the tank to this burner, but there's going to be no ignition source, so gas is flowing. Okay. So you limit the time that oh. you have it in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you put it here to on. You can hear it. And then you press the igniter until it lights. Once it lights, then you turn it down a little bit and it'll all start to flow. Okay. So you always turn these maybe about three quarters. And so you have one lit, but you have to work your way left to right. So you put this one to the orange and it's gonna catch and then turn it down just like the first one to the same. You want this one to catch, turn to the orange and then turn it down, make it the same. And then the last one, turn it down. Now, the grill is going to be on top of it normally, so you won't be able to see. You'll just have to hear and get a feel for them. But uh, like if you're only cooking for yourself, just in, just light one and leave the rest off. You know what I mean? Like the more, like light the number of burners according to the cooking amount of food you cook. It. Got it? Got it. Thank you.